Okay, so hi everyone, welcome to Green Creeper Games. Um, you may be wondering why is the YouTube, why is my YouTube logo on the side of the screen moving around, and why is it on a black screen? Well, answer is, we're watching the Faye channel video. I was going to do a first reaction, but I woke up and then watched it while forgetting that I was supposed to be recording it. So we're doing a full depth analysis instead, basically. You'll probably see a loot meme that I made earlier as the thing, but let's go. Um, so yeah, we, we all know this. It's just fair coming in. Um, slight note, wardrobe, wardrobe? Why am I saying wardrobe? Furnace there, just because it's winter. Nintendo's obviously trying its hardest. Got the summoning gate at the back with more summoning shit there. And here comes Feth flying in. Yeah, I've already seen this. We already know Hello, what the fuck's going to happen. When we last met, it was summer. Yes, it was. It's a lot chillier now. Here, anyway. But with all my fluffy feathers, the cold doesn't bother me so much. Okay. Oh, hey, the just get to the facts. We need to analyze this ghost. shit. Also, what are you using in that furnace? Because not white Some steam. Not it shouldn't be white. So it annoys me. Faye, fuck off. I'm Gay. Of We're just gonna skip. Yes, it's skipping because Faye is annoying. Faye there we go. We're in Let's Faye channel. Started. Fire Emblem Heroes and the Owl. Oh shit! Sorry, didn't mean to bring Here's that one up. Um, here we go. As always, the five orbs. Fair shut up. Um, okay, so we all know the order this is going to go in. It's going to go green, uh, colourless, red, yellow, blue, I think. I can't remember. I, I just know that blue's the end. Stop coming up, YouTube. Okay. So, yeah, we're getting... It's time for a special Choose Your Legends update! Yeah, we all know this by this point. I'm not sure why they didn't include the top 10 instead, but sure, why the fuck not? I also thought we were going to do Choose Your Legends again, but, you know, why not? Raven's the best! What? No, I don't hear any favouritism. Grim isn't a favouritist. Um, didn't... Didn't make the top ten. Didn't make the top ten, guys. This is why Luke got through. By Let's the power of memory. Oh, this is seriously how these got, units Press got here, up. though. It's Memes. Joshua. He play Joshua, um, Sacred Stoners. I wonder why he's called the Tempest King. <gasps> I don't know. Maybe because he's in Tempest Trials. <gasps> dun dun dun. Moments of sarcasm with Grim. Um, okay, so, oh, damn it, I missed it. Go back 10 seconds. Wait, we're, we're just going for this. Here we go. Wait, it's coming. Um, oh, wait, no. Did. Does that actually get... Here we go. So, as we can see from their stats, close defense, wind sweep, Ordhumala, I have no idea how to pronounce that, and Mimbo. Um, those are just his level 30 stats, so don't go nuts. Yes. People love memes. Also, we need to bring up how Mia. Looks like Yuki from Sword Art Online. Please, I'm going to make that meme and put it as the thumbnail as well as loot. Screw it, I'm doing memes for all of them. If you don't see a meme of all of the Choose Your Legends in the title, in the thumbnail, then call me up on it, please. I'm going to fucking do it. Also, I've never played Path of Radiance, so... Look at that face. Wait, wait. Just the mouth. The mouth was a mistake. Please, for the love of God, just don't zoom in on the mouth. Um. 
But yes, sword fighter, very, very fucking fast. Very fast. Comes with Luna as well, so that's useful. Shut up, Faye. I am superior after all. I'm superior after all. Oh my god, I fucking love loot. Sorry. I would suggest for loot sticking a Tactoy seal on her to make her blue Arvis, basically. With Fury, just build her like Arvis. It's Dorcas. Um, yeah, his Tomahawk is, like, counter-attack at any range. So, basically, he's a better Hector. Better Hector. Better Hector. Better Hector. Better Hector. I think I've repeated myself enough. Yeah, it, it's going to be different, that timing shit. Yeah, Joshua is free to play. They should have made Luke free to play. Because she was mean to the most. Shut up, Faye. Um... Okay. I bet a lot of you were looking forward to this. Just leave. No, I was. You all like me, right? No, we I hate you. To start getting ready for the next Choose Your Legends event. Um, uh, um I didn't just say that. Let's move on. Faye, be quiet, please. Thank it's you. It's time to talk about the next update. Yes, to okay. Fire update. This is important heroes. shit. I have lots of juicy bits of info to share. Okay. First up. Look, okay. I know IDC SAO Hector has already made this joke, but seriously, for fuck's sake, call them staffs. We are calling them staffs here. Right. Okay. Staff users are getting a boost. By the power of free star wrists. Oh, and actually, my lens is going to be usable for once, so this that's helpful. I wonder what pain plus is going to be like. <laughs> Everybody? Let's take no, a look at Sakura's things. skills. Mm, she can fear learn plus, fear like... plus. Fear plus isn't a bad idea, actually. And Wait, I think Faye now. brings it up. Fear plus yeah, here we go. Fear plus is attack minus seven, which is one more. And basically, threat and attack, no, seal attack. Three on anyone within two spaces. Which is a brilliant idea when you think about it, to be honest. Priest you might. know, mate, bringing staff users added. back into the meta. After combat, Imagine Jenny or any rival staff target, user now. And any foes within two basically. And, and then plus. bringing Physic restores 50% HP of attack. So guys, guess what? 50% of attack, eh? Healers are definitely coming back into the meta now, my dudes. Can we store even more HP? Yes, of because heroes will have attack. To Look at that, 20, because skills. her attack is 40. That, Look at this logic. Also, well done for using photos and shit. Those are just a couple here, wait. Absorb. We're, we're going to make a few predictions here. Absorb. Absorb 100% of damage dealt. Fear, we've already seen. Slow, speed minus 7 and within two spaces. Gravity, unit can only move one space with more damage. Pain does 15 damage. Panic is... Um, boosts become... Loot... Boot? Oh, mind fucked. Um, boosts become... Debuffs in opponents two spaces away. Candlelight, I'm not sure actually, because candlelight stops the opponent from counter-attacking any unit that then attacks it after it's been candlelighted. That's why I use it on Bridal Lynn still. But I'm curious to see what that's going to do actually. You might see my Bridal Lynn being used more. Physic we already saw. Um, recover. I'm just going to guess that's going to do 20. Let's say 20 HP. Marta is going to do hurts the unit or something. And rehab, I've got no idea. I'd love to see what this turns into, to be honest. So you've got seven attacking staves and four healing 
staffs. Oh my god, I call them staves. Oh no. Oh god, the amount of backlash I'm going to get for that. Um, and we're only five minutes in. Okay. Sounds like heroes who wield staves will be staffs. busy from Call them fucking staffs. Also, countdown is good. To make them trigger faster. Countdown is good. A trigger countdown of some special skills will be Wait, reduced just... by one. Not dying. Give me a sec. Here's a list of the skills that will be... Here we go. Uh, it's fun to know that Astro, Night Sky and Glimmer are called star skills now. It's pretty cool to know. Um, so we got our attacking skills, all of our rising and growing. Rising, growing, blazing. Um, so we know that, just as a heads up for people who don't know, rising is the basic, growing is a bigger area, and blazing is more attack. Just for those who don't know, you probably do. Um, Astra, 150% damage, Night Sky is an extra something damage, I forgot, and Glimmer is an extra 30%. Nice to know that they're bringing it down a not Well, boosting it a not not bringing it down. You get what I mean. Um, daylight, soul, noontime, healing, all nice. Let's carry on. Whoa, it looks like 18 Whoa. special skills are changing. Making me think of Felicia. This should increase God. your options. Like for inheriting skills. Uh, yes, it should it's lead good. To new strategies in battle, too. Um... For my information gathering special skill. Please do. I call it eavesdropping owl. <laughs> eavesdropping owl. So we'll just learn about face skill real quick. Eavesdropping owl. Call down 100. Snoop on the order of heroes to cover juiciest scoops on Fire Emblem heroes. So what is that? 100 days? 100 hours? 100 minutes? 100 seconds? Um. Well. I've got no idea, but eavesdropping out seems like a 100 days thing. Maybe, maybe not. Not up to me. Um, I've never had to worry about this, I'll be honest. I just send units home because I'm a shit player. Um, actually, we, we can learn what Fair has obtained, has got from this. Okay, wait. Here we go. Okay, wait, we're just gonna learn. We're gonna learn all about Fair and whoever owns the Fair account for Nintendo. So, we see that they are using their special Effie. Um, my third favourite Loli, Amelia. Um, Black Knight and Henry as an armour team. Funny is that they haven't hearted Black Knight, but meh, we'll go through that. Oh my god. Oh my god. They've sacrificed their Virion to someone. Also, who carries a level 2 Marth and a level 3 Gaius? Seriously. Fair. Grow up. Um, and they still haven't 5 starred Alphonse yet. I'm surprised at them. Um, Sakura and S emerge with Marth merged and Cecilia merged, and we'll learn some more. And here's Here we go, more about so Lucina, Cordelia, Julia, and Selif Corin. Now we, I'll compile a list of her five stars later. It will be quite funny to look at. Um, they haven't made any changes to their Cordelia. Um, yeah, we're now just going through Fair's unit. Oh, their five-star Sheena has got Moonbow, and they haven't taught her Fortify Armor. They're also using a plus attack, minus res Sheena. So, it looks like even Fair is affected by, um, shitty... Well, actually, it's not a shitty one. It's not bad, but it would have been better if it was minus speed. You know, just reviewing your units while I'm at it, Fair. Why not? Uh, Jafar, Ursula, um, Bunny Camilla, fuck you. Look, she has almost all of the bunny units. Well, when is she missing? She's missing Spring Xander. And we all know who she's summoning for then. 
Um, Klein at five star, Carol at five star. I probably would have sacrificed Klein for Crick Repost at this point. Asking for. Um, Hector. She has fucking Hector. She has Laszlo, but not five star. Special. Um, Xander, the Fot. Uh, Elm. I can't say the Fot, actually. All units are Fots. Um, she seems to get lots of Claire's, actually. This is quite funny. Of all 297 units, the most I've seen so far is Claire. Those of you who um, Jenny, Tiki, Celica. Oh, she doesn't look like she got Bridal Cordelia. And no five-star Camus, eh? Oh, wait, no, yeah, she did get Bridal Cordelia. Guys, we figured out who her favourite is. It's Bridal Cordelia. Bridal Cordelia is Fez's favourite unit. Look at this favouritism, guys. Even the game owner knows the favouritism of Bridal Cordelia. Um. Okay, I'm now worried about this Perry. A Rider's Bane Perry with Crick Repost, Hone Cavalry, Plus Res Free, Glimmer, Swap. I'm actually afraid if I meet this Perry in battle. Also, this armor team isn't her defensive, so be happy about that one. Um, I was hoping to get a look at her Reinhardt, but apparently no. Um, she has second favorite Loli, Delphia, um, Matilda, Ephraim, Summer Xander, Summer Release. I think that's Olwyn. Yeah. No, let me pause it. Olwyn, Camilla, Summer Corin, Inns, Tanner. Clive, well, who didn't get Clive, apart from me, shut up, um, Lucina, Brave Ike, Brave Roy, another Brave Ike, not merged, actually, I'm curious to what she's doing there, um, an Abel, which is quite funny, a Brave Lucina, where's Brave Lynn, where is your Brave Lynn, fair, we all know you better have a Brave Lynn, um, Leo, Oscar, May, um, Reinhardt, not Cassidy. made five star. Shut up about more heroes. Saber, Alincia, Azura, Inigo. Even fucking Fe got Inigo. Even Fe got Inigo. What is this? Why me? Why is it always me? How, do, how comes Fe got Inigo? This is favoritism. Favoritism, clearly. Even summoners. Um, performing Arts Olivia, another Takumi, Aira, Aya, however the fuck you say her name, Kada. We'll, oh, we got to look at her, actually. 49 attack, 40 speed. Um, oh, that's actually a neutral Aya. A hey, neutral Arya, well done. With, I think that's fortified defense. Um, just her base skills though, so. Shigir, how did you get Shigir after? Meh. Arden. Kane, another that Lucina. Flying Nawi. Oh, so, you know, this is fun just looking through our list. Let's not shed a tear because fuck them. We all hate who we sent home. Clearly. Use less stamina. Talk about. Someone please stamina bring in the Donald, Donald Trump meme into this. Please, just do it. But why though? Why are you only bringing this out now? Why didn't you do this ages ago? Please, intelligent systems. You're not very intelligent, are you? Or <sighs> Come on, let's get some better information. Don't give up. Give up. Okay. Back here again, are we? That felt a little light for a version update, didn't it? I mean, Come on. it's been a while since the last one, hasn't it? It has been like forever. Oh, well done. I get it. We're not done yet. Not done yet. God, fucking makes me think of Crom from Smash Bros.
Oh, do look at that. Divine Missile Tang. This this is actually a good idea, to be honest. I'm liking this. this new after the right of Wait, we'll, we'll do voices with Grim because people are gearing up for Traplin again. Will add a brand new weapon. Because people want Traplin back, you can have instead Trap Anna. You can have Trap Anna for a bit. This shrine is really similar to the one we explored before, but we've already made it to the depths. Because Grim can't voice act to save his life. Right yes, it is, isn't it? And look, a stone slab, just like the other one in the shrine. See, Sharina is clearly a trap. A new part of the main we all story. knew it. We all knew. It okay, are you ready for this? Oh dear brother, it's your time to shine. See, we, we all knew Sharina was a trap. Um, and I'm Alphonse gonna... is clearly a go now. I'm no translator, Sharina, but very well, I'll see what I can decipher I in the it? text. What's that all about? Speak what? not of this right, reveal I it got... to no one. May these runes never be transcribed. You are so enjoined. I art thou, thou art I. This is not a persona reference or anything. More. Um, anyway. Away from Grim being a dipshit. Here comes Effie. Hi, Effie. How are She's you? Holding a silver lance plus. <coughs> Not brave, Lance. <coughs> uh, sorry, guys. Just had a cough there. Don't know what was wrong. Just some random cough. Um. Also, that's not a minor speed, Effie. What are you doing? Plus attack. Yeah. Oh my God. Silver lance plus eighteen might. With HP plus 5. Well, welcome everyone to the brand new meta. Called Broken Units. Goodbye, Reinhardt. Hello, Divine Naga Julia. My voice just cracked. Let's try refining that silver lance plus um, and see anyway. what happens. Also, why would you go there for a defensive? Like, why are you going for defensive, Effie? We, we saw your Black Knight earlier. We, we saw your Amelia earlier. Why? Why bother? Like, this is Grim getting pissed. I mean... What a... No Draconic Aura. Effie, what are you doing? Why are you bouncing on the screen? Okay, I'm just gonna cover up the mistakes. There we go. All covered up. No. Get your... No. There we go. See? Are Mistakes are all cleared up. There? Um, mm, I see. more mistakes. Those are arena medals and refining stones. Um, arena, arena medals, medals, refining stones. Looks like we're getting just you can get regular arena matches boosts. And as event rewards. Try and collect as many so, as this can. looks fun. After all, to be honest. Pretty valuable, just like sacred coins. Yes, these are basically sacred coins. It's dipshit. Oh, sorry, no, it's Ephraim. He's got his lance, sorry. Equipped. Um, Why don't we see what happens fun when fact, we... apparently Sigmund, Ephraim's weapon, and Sieglind, Erica's weapon, are in an incestuous relationship. Don't ask me, I'm not the one who got that one, but, you know, just facts with Grim Creeper. Um... Sigmund basically getting Brash Assault 1. Well, not, not even 1. And it looks like some um, can gain additional abilities yeah, basically Brash Assault. Let's because screw Brash Assault. We'll just skip this part. Because fuck it. Um, yeah, Divine Dew. Basically, when you get shit. Here we go. So, using Divine Dew, you can forge Soul Catty, Mistletane, which we saw. Siegmund, Hortracleur, Fujin Yumi, and Deathly Dagger. Basically meaning... We're all fucked. Takumi, Jafar, Eric, Not Erica. Minerva, Michaelis. Um, Selif. No, not Selif. Um, Ephraim. 
basically, Eldegun, Lin, expect to see them all in the arena. Hope you brought your sword breaker robins. Oh wait, you guys don't like my sword breaker robin for some reason. Who's the laughing now? But this is wow, this is a good idea to be honest. Welcome to the brand list. new meta. Fuck what? everyone. Isn't that string of killing edge yes. Plus. Killing edge becoming slaying There's edge is a very good idea. People were very pissed off at this. Like Armor smasher, slaying there. spear, slaying hammer, guard bow, keen wolf weapons, handle like plus. Very good idea. Tire thing, divine tire thing, Durandal, blazing Durandal, Aura, Dark Aura, Excalibur, becoming Dark Excalibur, and Naga, becoming Divine Naga. Although, I'm most likely going to keep Naga on my Julia, because I like that defense and res too that she gets when she's getting attacked. It's just a personal preference, do what you wish. It's not up to me. Uh, this isn't the ice one, is it? Yeah, it is gold. Okay. So, yeah. Everyone pay attention to this. This is the good shit. Right here. Sandendary Summoning Hero Event. Um, yeah. We already know who this is if you've watched this. I know I'm not the first person you came to to watch this. But seriously. Grimm's Hit List. Um, screw Ike, screw Deirdre, screw Jenny, screw Spring Xander, sp screw Bridal Cader, um, screw Aya, I'm after Spring Camilla, Bridal Cordelia, Hector, and Celica as top priority. So, oh shit, sorry. I'm basically summoning green, this banner. Green and colourless is gonna be my aim. And if I get everyone I want, then... I'll move over to red, because blue isn't that appealing to me this time round. It's just Spring Xander and Bridal Cader. I'm not too interested in either of them, sorry to say. Um, even though I can make Xander focus. emblem, but I've got Laszlo for that. Um, okay, yep, that's what everyone the wants. For the five -star focus so basically, be they've done something percent. good. You can't get five stars that aren't those particular units. They've basically added the non-focus five star unit onto the boosted five star unit boost. So basically, it is a high amount. I would suggest actually spending money on this banner like I probably will. But, you know, whatever. Do what you want. Stay free to play. Don't, but... Well, at least create category, a new account if you get shit things. <laughs> um, yes, we already know who this is. It's Fjorm, or whatever what her name is. And we know that we get her for free. But seriously, November 2017, I hate to sound like Strategist Master, but don't spend those orbs. Shit, I can't do it with enough passion. Um, okay. Now we're going to go into Norse mythology here, so this is going to be a fun thing. Yes, we should move on. There is one topic left. It's, it's a snowflake, for those of you who have autism. I'm actually going to stay quiet now, because this is a fucking brilliant thing. I'll rewind onto it. Yes, I'm still alive. I'm just staying quiet. It's fucking amazing. Look at those graphics.
Okay, now I can talk again. What's this? Book two. Okay, we're just gonna rewind to the beginning of that. Legendary hero. Okay, Peter now I'm going to talk through it and give some explanation on everything. Okay, before it begins, we all know Fire Emblem Heroes is based loosely off of Norse mythology. For some reason, I still haven't uploaded the um, Bride of Blick and Heroes are Dead theory because I'm lazy and haven't actually got around to recording it yet. Shh. Grim, Grim is having issues with it. Um, anyway, but we all know it's based loosely off of Norse myth. Nor North? Well, it is kind of North. Norse mythology. So, I'll go through it when it appears. Ooh, I can't help dreaming about the possibilities. I wish I knew more about you, legendary hero. Fet is like that snowflake. Real special. Okay. So, we'll go full in-depth right here. So, we have Sean. I think that's her name. Sean. I can't speak. Old Jamaic. Um, but... Yeah, standing on the hills that we get at the beginning of the normal cutscene. Well, the book one cutscene, I'm now going to call. I'm going to call it book one for the old one with Alphonse, Sharina fighting off Xander and Lucina with Veronica. And I forgot his name already, fuck. Um, anyway. Yes, we'll just... Okay, Shorm is the Ice River. That runs through, um, not Asgirheim, that's four movies. Um, Yggdrasil in the rivers of Guinea Gap or something. I will, you know what? I'll upload a separate theory on this video because Grim is finding it too hard to think on his feet because this video is unscripted. But just one little tidbit I want to bring up. Wait, you know, wait, two little, well, technically three little tidbits. Not two big things and one small thing. Okay. Okay, H here are the two big things. Just gonna... Well done to all of you who just lost no no November. Congratulations, you've all just lost. To who everyone thinks is Loki. But yes. Have fun with that. Um, but as we see, ice magic, most likely. Explosion! Oh no, we need to get a Mega Man meme in here, actually. Um, someone's looking pissed off. But basically, what I see the next part as is basically Ragnarok. The end of the world, basically. They want to bring about the end of the world basically so I'm going to call the spell Ragnarok because it looks like Celica's Ragnarok but yeah as you can see it it actually wipes out all of the land Alphonse, Sharina and the Summoner were standing on yay what's this? a new challenge for the order of heroes? <laughs> I also see Anna becoming a bad person because she's not in any of the things. Jorm. Okay. Fjorm. Jorm. Fuck. Wait. Here we go. I, I see Serta actually becoming a unit. Also, we'll, we'll talk about him. So, as we know, he's got the scar across the face. That's a subtle reference to Odin from Norse mythology. Uh, we're also seeing the return of Raven Wings from uh, Awakening and Fates, where sorcerers had them on their back. So are we seeing double classes now? Really Perhaps. Scary. Maybe, maybe not. Thumbs. Also, Fair is using... Well, I don't... I hate to get all Englishy, but she she's using the kind of language where she's getting goosebumps from the hot guy. I, I mean, hot as in heat, not hot as in beautiful. Hot as in heat, okay? She, she's getting goosebumps from the fire guy 
but she wants to snuggle with the ice person. For humans, this would... You generally assume that would be the other way around, wouldn't it? But whatever. We'll just say fair's weird. Um, also, there is a crack along the ice um, crystal. Perhaps there is a problem with the ice? I don't know. But, hey, theories here, there, everywhere. You get a theory. You get a theory. You get a theory. Um, anyway, let's stop talking for a bit. And this shit. We need to actually view this with seriousness. Look at this. We get Fjorm for free, but it's not this I'm worried about. Yes, we know that she's guaranteed. It's it's this. Actually. Come on. Fjorm, whatever. Um, wait, sorry. You get her for free. Here we go. So, we see her get attack, defense, bond. So, I'm seeing, basically, that she's going to be a good kind of unit. Also, I'd like to point out the strange symbols in the top left, just under her face. I'm assuming the green is infantry, meaning, and... But it's the symbol just below that, the water kind of droplet that I'm worried worried about, to be honest. Are we seeing element units now, basically? She also gets light tier, so I don't know what that does yet, but it looks good. Um, attack, spur attack, no, drive attack, that's the one. Um, shield pulse, or whatever it's called. Light tier, which is another lake in... Um, Norse mythology. Basically, Shorm is Lady of Lakes. Sorry, Azira, move over, but yes. Shorm is the ice section of all the lakes. I'll, I'll, I'll cover this in a different video, actually. But look at those stats. I'm going to assume Leiptir is a 16 might weapon, because it's that. Um... Meaning that she'll have 30 base attack, 31 speed, 30 defense. So basically, she is a unit who has at least 30 in every skill. In every stat, basically. So, what is that? 150? No. 30 times. Yeah, that's 150 minimum. Plus 9, meaning that she is 159. 160, 164 base stat total. Just over Arya. Um, but yeah. A five -star ally. Uh, it's her There's skill. So meaning it's a defense skill. It. Also, did, did you just fucking see that? Clear chapter one of book two. Wait, She'll wait, come on. Come on. Attack. Look at this. Okay, so first we're going to talk about the background. We see lava and stuff. This is not the summoning pool that we know before. It's it's basically on fire. We have been invaded. We are basically being destroyed. Um, but look at this. She fucking jumps. Look at that. She fucking does a somersault. And attacks. And also this. This scares me. Lance Dragon. No longer are they flyers. They are dragons. Also, you didn't see her skill activate there, meaning that it is a res-only skill. Yeah, see, it's a, it's a res skill, basically. Um, but yeah. What, all for today? She's cold. Maybe it's because you spent so much time with Fjorm. Maybe, maybe not. If you know what I mean. Anyway, um, this was an attempt at analysis by Grim Creeper. Um, shit, I, I might have fucked up somewhere along there, but if you are watching this long, thanks. And bye.